Hi guys, Hi. welcome back. So today we're going to be doing like a sit down video. I feel like we should do this more often. Right, we're it's gonna be different because she's going off to college. So I'm going off to college. lots of updates, but this is going to be like, we asked on Instagram, we were like big sis advice, questions about us, teeth, that type of stuff. So it's like a big, a big mix of big Q and A, different questions. Right. So it's very much needed. Is it easy or hard to reconnect after not being together for a long time? No. No. <laughs> We've gone, I think like a month without talking before and then yeah. it's just like the same thing. We just yeah. like pick up where we left off. I'm like pretty impressed by how well we literally just like, <laughs> you know what I mean? We just like, usually it's awkward. Like sometimes the car ride is like kind of awkward and I'm like, uh, but, but this time it was literally just like 10 seconds and then we're like, right? so we did good this time. We did. <laughs> Who's taller, me or Emma? <laughs> you see, <laughs> This one's me funny. was this the same height. height. No, well, I was always like an inch taller than her. And last time I was here, we were finally the same height. Mm -hmm. We're both five seven. And then she gets here again, <laughs> and I literally shrunk. <laughs> she's literally five five now. I don't understand how that works. She's but... like two inches taller than me now, yeah. which makes sense. She's five seven. I'm five five, which right. makes no sense because on my driver's license it so says five, I'm seven. five seven. So some doctor lied to me, or like I, what? I don't, I don't, you must have shrunk because I didn't get any taller. She's definitely shorter now, so I don't. I don't know how that happened, but I'm five five now. Very bizarre. <laughs> I'm um, going to college. I'm going to college. I'm going to IPY, which is downtown Indianapolis because I live in Indiana and I'm going for nursing. So a lot of people have been asking. So that's what I'm I'm, doing. I'm still in high school. <laughs> right. You guys ever going to move in together? I don't know. That's a big fat question mark. We never just, ever talked about that. Yeah. It's, it's just, just, we talked about it a little bit because we, your mom was talking about YouTube yeah. and like social media with me. Like and having a channel together. But that, yeah. that's like a, such a like big a shot. Like a huge theoretical, like huge, huge theoretical. But like, it's just because I'm going to be in college. It's going to be hard to just, if we, if I did, pack up and move it out to like switch colleges and maybe not even do nursing and right. move all the way down here it'd be a huge life change but or i moved on there. it's like a thing that i feel like right. we always i think we have to be a little bit older yeah we're definitely i need to be out of high school to right actually talk we're about it like 17 and 18, so. <laughs> how does elizabeth feel about the situation with ex friends boyfriends everything um, I'm not gonna say much, but I feel like I did see it coming. There's like a couple things that built up to it. Obviously, she said like people yeah. don't know the whole story, so I, I feel like I kind of saw it coming, but I wish it didn't happen. Most embarrassing moment you know about the other person. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do when you like your friend's other brother? Oh. Well, other brother? Older brother, probably. Um, she doesn't have a brother, I don't have a brother. <laughs> so, Tough question. <laughs> Good luck to you, sis. <laughs> Seen it in movies and a lot of right. like the siblings get super upset right. and I like hear it from like people that have So like one of my friends she has an older brother and we like joke about it and stuff and she doesn't get upset I think it's the type of relationship that you have with the sibling mm -hmm. I don't know it's like sometimes it can be good and sometimes it can be I bad. personally let's just say theoretically you had an older brother and I had a crush on him I would I wouldn't say anything. I don't know. I feel personally, I would feel weird doing it. It would be weird. Yeah. Do you ever get matching best friend tattoos? I think I would. I would too. I would. If my dad would let me get a tattoo, I feel like I'd get one with you. You could totally just like get it right here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I well, do because my uncle actually does tattoos, so we see, could get. I would want. I would want to do one. Right. Tea about any boys? There's some. We know each other's boy. Yeah. Boy situations. little problems. <laughs> not problems. Like, not but like kind of problems, situations. situations Scenarios, chins, uh, possibilities, futures, yeah, older. past experiences. Hmm. Very interesting <laughs> situations that we're not going to put out there, but we know. There's we some. Know. A boyfriend thing we don't have boyfriends. No. Just always. Just always. always. We always are. Every time we make a Q&A. You went four months and then now we're back to the original no. <laughs> How often would you guys say you FaceTime? For the first year, we would FaceTime like every time. other day yeah. type thing. But like as soon as we got older, FaceTiming is just like... Right, we're just old and busy. Right, so we, we do like, it if, if sorry, go ahead. Sorry, you go. If it's like something <laughs> important, then we like call each other immediately. Or if it's like too long to text, then obviously I we remember call, this but... one night I was at Dairy Queen and something happened, and I like picked up the phone and uh -huh. called her. It's just like stuff like that. If it's like something super important, like right. I can't have like time to text and right. I call her, and that's when you know me. it's urgent, so you always answer. You know, want to have a family in the future. We're very opposite with this. Very opposite with this. We've one. noticed. I noticed this the other day. We're very opposite in a lot of things. <laughs> But opposites attract. Opposites do attract. Um, I do want a family. I want three kids. I used to want three kids. <laughs> I used to want to have two girls and a boy. <sighs> She doesn't want, uh, I don't do you want, want to get I married want though? Yeah, I want to get married. But what if your husband's like, I want kids? Yeah, he's in for a bad one, unfortunately. <laughs> I don't know. Kids are just expensive and a lot of responsibility. True. I don't know. Like, At the moment, I don't want kids anymore. I don't know why everyone wonders. We're both straight. <laughs> Might as well just put yeah, it out there. We were asking you about our sexuality. We support everyone. Yes, of course. But we're straight. We're just friends. <laughs> <laughs> Did we just 
<laughs> yeah, funny. First Wait, case story. I was in the car, obviously with my ex. <laughs> we were out sitting outside my house and we oh got ice cream. God. It was like 11 o'clock, not 11, it was like 10.30 at night. And like, he just like, I was gonna get out of the car and he just like, I don't even know how it happened. I think he just like, that. <laughs> we kissed and then. And then you said what? <laughs> Um, I was 16, we were at a cabin on a little vacation, and he was a little older. Not a lot older. He was older than me. No, we didn't date. I don't know. Just in the moment, I guess. Don't flame me, but it just kind of happened, I suppose. Nothing, nothing exciting. Like, we didn't date or anything. It's First kisses are so... So weird. So bizarre. Everyone thinks they're romantic, and they're not. you get to them, they're and you're literally like, so bad. Right? It was hard seeing your friends struggle and not be able to physically be with them. I was thinking about this when um, when she broke up with her boyfriend. I was like, man, she's really going through a whole breakup right now, and I can't be there with her. Like that must have been terrible, dude. Yeah, I know it's tough. For her. I know it was tough for her. It was rough. It's obviously like we text about it, whatever. She'd like text me when she's sad at like three in the morning. <laughs> But like, <laughs> there's nothing I can say to make it better, and it's not like I can just sit here and like give her company. So right. it's like I literally couldn't do anything, which sucked really bad. I hated it, but I do agree. But I feel like you haven't went through something like mm -mm. a breakup where it's like where I had to be there for you. Right. That was like the first real time where I yeah. noticed like, oh, I'm not there. Um, is high school bad or scary? What's it like? We have two very different opinions on this, so I'll let <laughs> the good one go first. Um, high school isn't scary at all. Um, if you're worried about like seniors being mean or whatever. It's such a myth. They literally don't they're, care. No. They don't care. Literally all they're trying to do is get out of high school and literally. like finish their grades. Like they're not gonna like stop and throw you in a trash can. Right. Like that's, that's like, like a movie type thing. Yeah, no, that doesn't like actually that. happen. Right. It's don't be scared because all the freshmen are in your shoes. Like, right. They're all nervous. Right. They get scared and nervous and it gives you a good opportunity to make new friends. Yeah. Starting freshman year. Start oh, keep both doing that. <laughs> start taking your classes. Like, no, I would say do dual enrollment and like Mm -hmm. start your classes like hard in freshman year yes. i made the mistake of not doing anything like honors or like ap uh -huh. and i did this year and it brought up my gpa so much and i wish i started in freshman year yeah because set like, yourself up good um when you die what do you want to be remembered for this is a deep question deep. i feel like i don't have goals for myself other than like i don't want to be like i want to be the richest right. i want to be like the best at this but like i just i don't know just as long as people thought i was nice and yeah like a good person right and just, i also just want to re be remembered as having a good life and being happy, not working a nine to five and like being so miserable. Right. Cause like your family members look at that as well when you die, like when you right. die, like they're at their funeral, like, oh my God, she was so like, not driven right. like type thing. So right. what color nails would you recommend for the beach? White. Um, I would say any light, nothing dark, a super light purple or like a super light blue or white. Yeah. Like she said. What is your friendship song? <laughs> Pillow talk! It changes. It changes every time. Now it's still driver's Last license. Last time was driver's license, yeah. but it still kind of is. Yeah. But this time we're listening to reasons. Pillow Talk. Yeah. Right. We, every, <laughs> wherever we are at night, because we usually go off on yeah. our own. Every single time we get into her neighborhood, we play driver's license and we like scream it. It happened last time, happened this time again. Yeah. And there's a little special kick to it, but we won't explain it. But I live in Indiana. What are some fun things to do here? Nothing. <laughs> Literally nothing. <laughs> this is my favorite. Why do men? Girl, I don't know. Everyone wants to know if you've gotten to a fight before. And no. Mm, I think we there's have. like one. Okay, you remember? I feel like there was one time and I don't even remember what it was about. It was about that boy, Aiden. There was this one time we had like a little disagreement, not a disagreement, it was more of like, I don't even know how to put it, so yeah. we met this boy at my sister's birthday party. <laughs> we saw him in an elevator. We're not gonna bring this up again. <laughs> oh my god. And I'm pretty sure we both liked him at the time. <laughs> It wasn't even an argument, it was just like, okay, let's stop talking to him type thing. Uh -huh. And then a big fight yeah. where it's like, we stopped talking for like a month or two months or anything. We're becoming we're adults. We're growing up, that's what that's it is. That's yes, We're growing up, so. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and we'll see y'all soon. See you Bye. later. Bye.